is Tuesday the 10th of July and I'm just coming back from dropping Leslie off at her transition day. We have moved, um, yeah we have officially moved, well I say we all have moved, if you don't know me and the girls have moved in with my parents and Scott is still in Stoke, he's moved in with his uncle and we are just trying to save up a bit of money and find a house we want instead of just trying to grab one for quickness and then this way we can find a house that's big enough for us and also save money at the same time um so yeah the sun's come out and it's so bright and i've got a jumper on but yeah so i've just dropped alessia off at her new school she was a little bit nervous this morning um once we got to the gate she was kind of like i don't want to go in um, but it turns out that there's a couple of kids starting in year five in September so I think that made her feel a little bit better so that's good. So we've been here for Saturday, Sunday, Monday. So this is the fourth day and Nyla has been absolute nightmare. Not as in naughty, I don't mean nightmare as in naughty. Um, but she's just so unsettled, she only wants me and she's screaming. Um, if I leave her, if I literally stick her in the high chair and go to the kitchen, she can still see me, it's kind of, it's, I don't know how to explain it, but she can still see me. She will scream, like scream her head off. Um, yeah, it's, it's very emotionally and mentally draining. <laughs> yeah, I haven't had two minutes without her. Um, hopefully it eases off. Um, I do feel sorry for her, I do, because the unsettledness and I know she's missing Mez. Um, but it has only been four days, so hopefully she'll be okay. Um, yeah, she's going to sleep now, which is a bonus. She is out for the count, so I'm hoping I can get some breakfast and sterilise the bottles before she wakes up. We have resorted to the carrier to see if I can make some breakfast. She's had her breakfast, she's had some raspberry wheaties. Oh yeah. Hello baby. <laughs> Hello baby. And she's tired again. I need to get some breakfast. It is quarter to 11 and I'm not eating yet, so I'm pretty hungry. I think I'm going to do bacon. Yeah, bacon and eggs and tomatoes. Oh. Yes, and you'll probably eat it with me, won't you? You'll probably eat it with me, won't you? Clever girl. Clever girl. Form, yeah, tell me all the stuff we're in for September. A oh, pretty good experience because someone else in, who was my age, yeah, yeah there's a couple weren't there in year five, yeah, but there was three boys and one girl in year five, but there was like others for different things. So we were all in this room, it was like an assembly gathering. I found out that's where we actually had lunch. Oh, is it? Yeah. Yeah, the ducks are chasing us. <laughs> yeah. So I just made that. To, um, ducks are everywhere, aren't uh, they? So yeah, we were in this room and then there were like Alessia, Sam, such and such, such and such, Daisy. You are come with us. We stand up on a bench and I had to like swap around our team to get in an order. It was really fun. And yeah. then we got home. The end. And you got some sweeties, aren't you? And I got some sweeties. She's got some sweets, so. Yeah, I literally, that picture in there was literally my dream. Was it? Oh my god, that was scary. Has she 
she got some sweets and she's gonna get a magazine but there's not any that she likes so, so we're gonna get a David Walliams book we're gonna order her a David Walliams book off Amazon because she loves reading so I'm glad you've had a good day I was a bit worried about you but I knew she'd be fine we're gonna go home get some dinner your favorite dinner that Nanny does is um, mince and mash mince me and mash Chill out, aren't we? Dad and are asleep. Come on, triplets, let's go. Daddy Pig is drinking from the water fountain. Yay, that was a hit. Happy Pig is Daddy, alive. can we have some water in our bucket, please? Actually, no, I can't touch it. I'm gonna. No. What's the dinner? One episode of it. What? Where's Mrs. Hedgehog? Here he is. Where's Mr. Owl? Here he is. See? Where's Nyla? No. <laughs> Where's Nyla Bug? There you are. There you are. The girls are asleep. It's Love Island time and I'm gonna redo my nails. I painted them yesterday. I've gone a bit, I don't know, you see they're a bit see-through. I don't know what's going on there. I'm gonna put my hair back in a bun so it's curly for tomorrow because we're going Norwich. We're going shopping tomorrow so I've got all the kids clothes out ready so we can just get up, have some breakfast and then get the bus because I think we're getting the 10 o'clock bus. And it's meant to be nice tomorrow so yeah i hope we have a really nice day but i'm just so glad that alessia has had a nice day at school and she's absolutely buzzing for september so yeah i'm really really happy for that so i'm gonna watch love island and i'm gonna snuggle up in bed i've got loads of blog work done tonight as well so i'm all up today i'm missing mare's like absolute mad but we can do this i know we can do this so yeah, it's Love Island time now, cup of tea, and then 